Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is AC Boy Gaming, bringing you another Fire Emblem Inheritance Part 1 gameplay. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit that bell for more notifications on my channel. Thank you. Chapter 3, Cog of Destiny. Um, Their faces bring to that fort down the path. Their traces bring to that fort down the path. Okay. It probably is a stronghold. I'd like to charge up front, but it would be suicide. That place teams with bandits. We are quite a few. We have no possibilities. Maybe the best option is to wait till it gets dark. Okay. This new character is at, uh, saying that she might be able to help us. Interesting uh, tone of blue all over. Um, why is that? What are you doing here? Our ever, ever vigilant leader Ernest asking the questions around here. A friend of hers has been captured, forced them to join the band. Unfortunately, this place is very. Uh, she spent some days trying to find her way around, discovered the second entrance. Ernest asking where's the second. Okay, so she's a thief. She's going. She's going to. Uh, Use her thieving skills in this chapter, apparently. Her R combat abilities with her thieving skills equals passing the chapter, okay? So we're going into our setup. Got Ernest, Matilda, Oliver, required units. And I'm leaving Reyna out because, like I said, I want to develop my units. And I do not want to have a promoted unit come up. Oh, yeah. There's also that. She can't participate in this chapter. Okay, so I'm setting, setting up my, uh, what is it, my arsenal. It's really fun how the, um, what is it, the light tones in this game have added luck bonuses. I think that's fun, you know, to have weapons that have added bonuses. Okay, scoping out the map free. Got a hero as the Mr. Garchomp. Not the Pokemon, but. <laughs> um, okay, we got someone with a talisman. You have to be very tactical to try to steal that. Every item is valuable in any game. And so we'll make our attempt to get it. Okay, so I'm trying to set up. Set up who goes where. Chapter 3, Cog of Destiny. Let's go. Okay. That's the entrance. As you can see, there are no guards patrolling outside. Um, yes, they are very stupid. He's not feeling well. She's not feeling well. Okay. Okay, so she's going to warn us about reinforcements. Okay, so she comes with an iron sword and knife. I love it when Thieves comes with those freaking shuriken style. I, I just love that, man. Uh, Duelist blow, cunning. Despoil. I like the uh, shove and steal. Okay. Yes, sir. Why would I go with the blessed lands first? Okay, good job, Rod. Okay, I'm gonna talk to 
when he was young, he used to live in the streets. He, he used to rob people. Okay, so he's saying he can, he offers the same skills. Okay. Spoiler alert, you can fast forward this if you don't want to hear it, but yes, Oliver is a monster. That's not the spoiler. Um, so here, here's the spoiler right now. Um, Oliver was holding that guiding ring and as you can see, he wasn't able to use it. And you're probably wondering why when he's a mage, but um, that guiding ring will then be used later in the chapter. It's very important. Like I said, the creators of this hack are very cre creative and very resourceful. And so um, their, uh, they put that guiding ring to a unique use in this hack. And so make sure that you keep that guiding ring handy okay hey they're getting close come on go attack them but i'm an archer i can't stay you archers are perfect to be the enemy uh always using the weak man okay so if he helps okay oh man so if he helps he gets killed and if he doesn't help he gets killed <laughs> Okay. Oh man, I hope I can reach. Hold on. Okay. I'm gonna take this guy out. Okay, Thunder Lightning. Yes, sir! Whoo! <sighs> Brought to you by Oliver, the Destroyer. <laughs> I cannot reach him. I'm one step away from him. Let's go see what we can do. Okay. Um. God, why didn't I just shove it? Shove it. Oh, there. Okay. There we go. Shove. Top. You here? Oh, thank God. What are you for? Follow me. <laughs> I just breeze through these things. I got so excited to play it. Yeah, so I'm going to go back and take that guy out because he's talking a lot of smack. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. i do some damage to this guy. Oh, my goodness. You know, you can go ahead and go back to the enemy. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna position Ina here with the sword weight. And I'm gonna staff Mr. Ernest here because he got shot in the leg by Mr. Gnome, our newest member. <laughs> okay. And equip the steel sword for safety purposes. Got it. And then we're gonna advance our other units. We got Zed the Rim Rocker here. I'm gonna place him just below the entrance. Don't want him overexposed. And then we got Rod. What are we gonna do with him? I'm gonna pop a vulnerary. Oh no. Or not. Okay. Oh, come on. Oh, man, that would not have looked nice. Okay, so the reinforcements came. And Gabba's mercenary is going to need reinforcements from Oliver, but sadly, there's no one. They have to face the music. Nice little level up there, as always. Oh, we got a chess key. Oh, I sent the chess key. Probably should have kept it. Okay. 
We got a mage up there at the top. There's only one out of other physical units. Not too many magical units around here. Okay. Gonna reposition with Bruce Lee Roy. that wall so that we can oh I can hit that guy oh 20 oh good night that's fun okay got a mercenary on the left Type map. Um, as you can see, there are also not only are the pathways tight, little, little heal with Ernest there. Not only are the pathways tight, but um, even the pathways to get to the treasures are looks like little obstacle courses to get our nice little treasure there. Wasted a knife there. <laughs> Probably wasn't one of my best ideas, but. Oh, I was supposed to break it with a gnome, but ended up getting that nice little uh, KO. Crit KO at that. Okay, so. Got Lad here, ready to take out anyone. But. If the memory serves me correctly. I go even fur I go even one step further and place Rod. Yep. Place Rod there because his weapon is higher in the weapon triangle. And of course I place Lad there because his weapon is higher than the other opponent on the other side. On the weapon triangle. So it's Lance Smash. Oh, I'm sorry, Rod Smash and Lad Smash on both sides. Okay, we got Zed, last unit to move. Oh, and Ernest. Let's see powerhouses. Okay, I'm gonna Criticals for everyone. Passing out criticals. Rated E for everyone. <laughs> that level up is crucial. And I got a red gem. Thank you. That's, a, that's what we call a ur, out of range. <laughs> Why wouldn't I do a ranged attack? Oh, I guess it wouldn't matter. Okay. Oh, I'm in range of that. Major there. Yeah, my placement out. See, at the, at the, I, th I think at the time I didn't know that those little ropes and barrels were part of the obstacle course, and I guess I just put the beef there. I don't know why I didn't advance further. Moving on. Unfortunate. 
they had a little bit more range. Time to take this. Oh, what? Wow. I was going to say time to take this guy out, but. A rather strong physical unit. Okay. See, I'm being tactical. I'm not being over over the edge and attacking them. Exposed. See? I put them under cover. That way the next turn. When the enemies come, they lower their ch I lower their chances of putting their hands on. Yeah, I don't know. I wish I had enough to uh, take out that axe fighter so I can advance forward faster. Oh, here we go. Yep. Perfect execution. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's what we were talking about. Get some. Oh, gosh, that hurt. See, in range. And lucky my Bruce Leroy can't, can't reach. Take you out. Okay. Yep. Yeah, we're going to take this guy out. Let's go. Come on. Okay. Oh, he has a red. Oh, man. Hmm. Let's go see what I do in this situation. So I have Ernest, an attack, 17. Just enough to take him out, but let's go see. I also have to remember that there is a brigand to the south of me. Okay. Okay. We're here. We're still here. <laughs> Sorry for the AFK moment. Okay, we're back in action. Um, what am I gonna do here? Okay, I'm going to advance around this maze. See, that's what that's what I mean by oh, nice dragon shield. I like this. Like, I like the way these uh, creators think, the creators of this hat, because I mean, if you think about it, they didn't make it so easy where we just go and take the treasure right they put the treasure then we put an obstacle to go around so even more planning and tactics went into uh go into the player's uh strategy uh, i thought i was gonna get a nice little crit there okay i mean yeah it can be argued that it the same goes with other games but i'm not playing other games i'm playing this game this hack, this version. So I'll say what I want. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, please. I would really love to grow this channel and bring this hack to the world and have everyone play it. Feel how I feel about said hat okay let's go see what I do here oh yes this axe is rated E for everyone everyone can get it mm. come on make the right decision yes okay ah come on now I'm poisoned Always got to scope the field. Always got to make sure you're not setting yourself up to get absolutely wrecked. And as you just saw, 
I got wrecked by that uh, Vantage. I think that was the Vantage skill where um, if the HP is below 50%, they strike first. Yeah, I caught the south. I, got, I caught the tail end of that one. <laughs> well, lucky I had my mend ready here. Okay. And now about to, oh, even better. Yep. Just served him a full plate of WA compliments, coast of stone cold. I was gonna say cold stone, but that's the ice cream place. Uh, that's so funny. Yep, that's why I put myself with a hand axe rather than getting him something. Else. Oh, come on. Got hit. Okay, now would be a now would be the time to uh, use that mend on Zed as well. But I'm looking for blood first, and so we go with my headshot straight to the dome. Okay, yes, there you go. Staff. Mend. You're welcome, Zed. Open this door. Position, I know. Don't do it. Don't do it. No, don't do it. Just position him. Yep, there we go. Yep, no. What? Okay. There we go. I'm gonna position, position him here. So the mercenary can hit me, and then I can take him out with any of my ranged units. And then I have Zed here to seal the deal. As you can see, I got Bruce Leroy up in the top left of the steps, shutting down any who attempt to enter my domain. I'm looking back at this, I may have overexposed Ina by by putting her so far up with with about three enemy units um, and her own by herself with no backup and within a turn um, and so now I'm bringing Rod and Lad up. That leaves Bruce Lee Roy right here. Level up. Okay. Ah, oh, it's like a little bee stings. Okay, I moved Rod and Lad a little bit too early. Let's go see what I do here. Okay, I got the blue gem there. Work on either of these two superior sword users here. This doesn't work like that. Take that mend. Lucky that hit. Man, I wasn't even thinking about it when I was going through this. Now that I look back at it. Steel Lance. Okay. Uh, steel Lance. Steel Lance. Let's go. Thank you, Zed. I can always count on you. Okay, now I got, I'm going to close the, seal the deal with, what? Okay, I was just making sure that he couldn't touch Oliver. 
Good night. Probably not the most reliable unit to take on such physical units. Okay, and they came to me, so that's better. Okay, six damage, not so bad, but I'm only at 21 hit points. Okay. Got a little while away. hoping I could get a nice little crit there but I wasn't able to mm -hmm. so I wanted to try to get that talisman again we want to be tactical okay, maybe I should try to hit him with the javelin come on Hit him with the javelin. No, nope. it's too close. No. Come on. What am I thinking here? I guess I'm thinking how I, how I'm going to yeah okay I was thinking how I was going to do my inventory without throwing away something too valuable okay okay great <laughs> nice to know I didn't lose it my wits, that is. Oh, there. Oh, I didn't see that. Let's go. Still overextended out of uh, too close for comfort. Mm. And I, I probably should have deployed Bruce. Bruce no, not probably. I should have deployed Bruce Leroy uh, faster. Mm. Okay. Let's see. Am I not gonna? I should try to see what my knife can do. But I guess I didn't do it. Hmm. Interesting. Um, take that, keep that mend for you, Zed. Oh, thank you, Miss Oh, you're welcome. 
Okay, so I have four units uh, as enemy reinforcements. And again, they are... Lad will be on the la uh, right side of the screen. And Lad will be on the left. Take the positions. Let's go. Ah, oh, hit by another poison. Okay. Man, that would have ended me. Oh, yes. And I got a <laughs> consecutive strike. Thank you. Ooh, she's just dodging bullets at this point. Good job, Ina. Ooh. Too close for comfort, I tell you. Okay. Take him out. I must say, archers have got to be some of the best units. But I say that about kind of every unit. <laughs> yeah, I just love these games so much. Fire Emblem and this hack, like in general. I want to be in range of that other time. I got a little bit. Let's go. Time to put him to sleep. Goodbye, vulnerary. Hello, talisman. Okay. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Let's go see what I can do to this guy. Kind of damage. Got a hand axe. He has a hand axe equipped, and with my falchion, my steel sword has a better. What? Is the falchion like supposed to be like? Anyway. Yeah, so I'm gonna wait. <laughs> That's a hard wait. Hmm. Normally I use the mend to get more experience points. But that'll work. Time to take out this little nuisance. Yep. <laughs> Kept stinging me from far away. And all it took for was one shot from me. And that's what you get, little mage. Got two more chests to open up. Okay. Okay. I see you, Rod. Yeah, I did not account. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> You step into the lion's den, you better be ready to get eaten. Come on. Oh, wow. This guy came out at the wrong time, though. Got a nice speed wing there. Don't know what Z uh, Zed's gonna do against that hero. It's okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Put him to sleep. Let's go. Very thankful that I hit because looking back, 88% to even 88% isn't strong enough to guarantee you a, a hit. So it's 
Especially for Myrmidons who are master evaders. Tried to be smart again by doing a ranged attack. Well, I probably should have just done it. Close combat. A little CC action there. All right, let's go take him out now. Nope, not yet. This one, I think I'm a, I'm going to charge the commander. Good night. Gotta make sure that Ina doesn't get hit by him because he's a powerful unit, man. <clears throat> that hero is a Mr. Garchomp, no Pokemon. Okay. put him on the stairs. I don't know why I put them so close together. Anyway, here we go. I just don't even try, man. Yeah, for that one, I would place Ernest in front of the boss to take that first hit. Oh, but I think I'm trying to get experience points for other members of my unit. some moves here yeah see I was yeah I figured I was waiting for oh my lord look at that Oliver yes I dare challenge you and I dare take you out okay got a barrier thank you Why did I rescue him? <laughs> I guess I was just getting him out of harm's way, but I don't know. What am I doing here? I should just, I should have just attacked him with a sword. Why didn't I do that? Oh, maybe he has another. Okay. Just the turn that I do what I keep thinking I'm saying I'm gonna do. Or what I keep saying I'm thinking I'm going to do. Uh, just waiting, waiting, waiting. Uh, yeah, I'm hurrying. So reliable. 
Oh, that's what I was doing there. Okay. I see you now. Okay, I was okay. I see what I'm doing now. I decided I was gonna take him out with Oliver because Oliver was my favorite unit, uh, playable unit, and so I wanted him to get all the experience points. Mhm. Mm oh shoot! <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Oh, and it just keeps getting better. Yep, I'm just boss spamming at this point. Let's just see what I got here. Should take him out first. 25, yeah, let's go. Take him out. Click OK. There you go. <laughs> I keep making myself nervous. <laughs> okay. Still lands. Probably just gonna wait. Oh, or just use a jab. Oh, yeah. That'll work too. Okay, now I gotta take care of this. Bozo. With Bruce Lee Roy. Hopefully, I get a crit. You know? Okay. Fair enough. Still gotta level up. I got Mr. Gnome. Ready and willing to sink one in between the eyes. And last but not least, 14 out of 20 turns. I'm just getting too close for comfort, comfort here. I need to close out this chapter. Sometimes I even question myself. <laughs> Never question yourself. Just kidding. Never question yourself. But I'm thinking I should have put Ernest in front of him a long time ago. What am I waiting for? Oh, I think I'm looking for the, if any other reinforcements came in. Oh, uh, yeah. There we go. And Zed is never going to get out of poisoning. <laughs> Level eight. Okay. Can we please take care of business? Good night. Okay. Wait. Probably shouldn't have put him so put her so close to the wall because I axe wielder has a hand axe. I think I have my lance still equipped. All right. See, so he does have a hand axe. I shouldn't make it. Mm. Still safe. So we're good. Just gotta take out Mr. Garchomp, no Pokemon here. Mr. Garchomp, aka Garcia. From the original Fire Emblems. <laughs> take him out. That's an order. No? Okay. Yep, see, he didn't take him out. Okay, this, this is the turn. No idea. 
goodness. Oh my goodness. Let's go. That's a really good uh stat line or not a that's not even a stat line. That's a really good uh It's really good that I get a double against a promoted unit. Good job. Okay. Making sure I had all my grounds covered before I ended the chapter. Because more than likely this would have yeah, see because I have 28 damage here. And I'm gonna have about roughly 26 damage here. Yep, 26. <laughs> How did I know? You may defeat me, but you never defeat Gaba. And you can say I knew because I played it before I recorded this, but <laughs> mind you, it's been a bit of a time before, uh, uh, I mean, since I've seen this gameplay, and so I just get so excited. That's such an awesome way to finish it. Plus, I didn't have any crit points, so that was more of like a little special special addition there. Okay, I don't know why I'm moving in, but I just need to seize the throne. We're good. Okay, so I'm healing everyone. Okay. I see what I'm doing now. Gotta heal everyone. And we have seized the chapter, everyone. Thank you. You stop right there. We haven't finished here. Tell us where it is you've taken the little boy. Stand where you are. Ha <laughs> ha. Blast the kid. All right, now drop your weapons on the ground, or or this kid will be a bloop. A, will die. <laughs> and Reina sniped him. She got him. Nice job, Reina. That is what I call a good shot. You better throw down your weapons and let us tie you up, or I will draw a smile on this girl's throat. Let me go, please. What? God, Chime, you really got worked over, huh? All right, that female on that horse, she shot me with an arrow. <laughs> that woman, okay. Oh, man. Did you see how well I hit that blow dear Ernest why don't you calm down and let them tie you up you're with them you yes and now tell me where you keep the family stone that's a secret just tell me never especially after your man killed Reyna it is a secret of our family I would never reveal such a thing Gabe convince him let me go help me Ernest leave him Tell us where you keep the stone. Let him go. I'll never reveal where it is. You're wasting your time. Okay, I'll start with him. Ernest. <sighs> he is a bastard. And that concludes our gameplay, Chapter 3, Cog of Destiny. Once again, thank you for coming to my channel. If you liked my content, please remember to like this video, comment what you think, tell me how I can enhance the experience, and most importantly, subscribe. This is AC Boy Gaming, and I am honored to have been able to bring you this video. Peace!